There's a rumor that a suspension bridge made entirely out of duct tape is so strong you could even dance on it. To put that to the test, they first measured the tape's strength. A single strip could hold about 67 pounds, meaning just four strips together could support the weight of an adult. The problem? The sagging was way too severe. To fix this, Adam layered and wove five strips, each eight tapes thick, to spread out the stress. That made the tape sturdy enough for a real trial. They went to a shipyard with a 160-foot dock and set out to build a full-scale duct tape suspension bridge. Back in the workshop, they made all the parts out of tape, even the handrails, which Jimmy twisted together with a power drill. After pre-stretching the tape to reduce sag, they used a crane to assemble the bridge across the dock. In total, it took 236 rolls of tape, weighing in at 410 pounds. With everything ready, Adam was the first to cross. At the start, the bridge felt surprisingly steady, but the farther he walked, the more it swayed. Without a safety harness, there's no way he would have attempted it. It took him five minutes to reach the other side. Then it was Jimmy's turn. Maybe because of his weight, the bridge began to shake violently after just a few steps. The swaying was so intense that he dropped into a crouch, inching forward, half squatting just to keep his balance. In the end, with the safety line keeping him secure, he made it across in 10 minutes. So yes, duct tape really can hold up as a bridge. But as for stability, let's just say it's not exactly confidence-inspiring.